So I shared, talked about this a while back on Twitter, is I was recently trying to upgrade my phone, and I wanted a Note 10, and I thought it would be a good phone to have. So I found one, I, almost too good to be true price, and the case being, it was. Got this, it looks mildly convincing, I mean the font's wrong already on it. And then you look at the cameras, and you realize one actually is a camera, and then the other two are just little black orbs. Uh, and also, <laughs> this software is definitely not the recent thing. And I tried to convince the seller that, hey, you had a fake phone, and you sold it to me. That's sort of illegal. And they're like, well, it's not like I'm supposed to know that. It's your fault for buying it. You had buyer beware. So I contacted the official site holders, which was eBay, which I already knew I was going to be screwed on that part, and they couldn't do anything about it. So I basically, I'll, I'll tell you the number, spent $750 on a piece of shit that doesn't work. And instead of trying to get my money back, I thought of a better idea. Jeez! Is dead. But look, look! There is practically diddle inside this shit. You really, you really expected this to be okay? Oh, oh, oh! That's cracked. That's gone. That's obliterated. One magical throw. You know, I've been under a lot of stress too. So this was that was mildly satisfying. That's gone. That's that is a Remember kids, shop smart. Don't be like me. Or else you're gonna really really wish you had that seven hundred and fifty dollar back. But it's dead now. And I feel better about my life. So yeah. Thank you for watching. I'll see you guys later. Bye.